good morning it is monday the 8th of may which is a bank holiday and i am going to be off monday tuesday wednesday so i thought i would start another little vlog um so my only plans today was to go for food with some friends this evening uh, me and james went to windermere on a day trip yesterday so i fully expected to be having just a really nice chilled day uh, but jess my sister wanted to go to durham um, so we're now going to get the train to Durham and we're going to have a Nando's and just have a little look around the shops. Um, the weather is horrible here um, so I can't imagine it being much better in Durham um, but obviously she's off with it being a bank holiday um, and back at work tomorrow so that's what we're going to do today. I'm just obviously doing my skincare. And then we're going to get ready and pretty much just try and go as soon as possible. I feel like since starting these vlogs... I mean, not that I've got the most adventurous, luxurious lifestyle or anything. I would say I've got a very boring, ordinary life. But I feel like, yeah, since starting these vlogs, I've actually been up to quite a lot. Like, I have actually had quite a few, like, days out, been food quite a lot, which is not like me. And I don't know if it's, like, I feel, because I'm vlogging, that I want to make that effort a little bit more. Um, You know, kind of since COVID and buying a house, I just, like haven't really done anything like especially me and james like we have never done anything just us for as long as i can remember and we've had quite a lot of plans together recently just us which has been nice also just ignore <laughs> my fringe poking out there i was gonna straighten my hair today but because it's raining i don't know if there's any point i might straighten it later for when i go out for the meal but to walk around durham potentially in the rain yeah i don't think there's much point few hours now um, and I've literally had my pyjamas on and just been laid chilling on the sofa because I've been so tired. Um, I'm just going to have a bit of a freshen up with my makeup before we go out um, but yeah we had a really nice day just sort of obviously looking around the shops and um, I didn't actually buy myself anything but it was nice to just have a little look anyway. A few Nando's I got like it didn't look that great to look at um, but it did taste really nice. I got like a 
chicken grilled chicken pita with peri peri chips um and i actually got it in medium heat and i was panicking a little bit because jess was like she got lemon and herb and my mum and grandma got plain um but i usually like a bit of spice but then i started thinking like oh my god what happens if it's really spicy but it wasn't it was literally fine um yes yeah, so we had a nandos i got a bubble tea really bloated after having the nandos but now that i've obviously like just chilled on the sofa for a few hours um it's settled down a lot so i definitely feel ready for my indian tonight which it's also a first for me because I literally injured once before and it was years and years ago. Morning, it is now Tuesday. Um, so I didn't actually film the food last night, but I did take pictures, so I will have inserted the clips. Um, but it was so nice. We went um, for an Indian, um, and I actually chose some like little small plates instead of getting like a curry, and they were really good. And we got some cocktails, um, and then as soon as I got home, I literally took my makeup off and went to bed. Um, so this morning, I've just been like having breakfast, letting Macy out, um, just like scrolling social media on my phone to be honest um but i do want to do a lot of tidying and organizing today because tomorrow james is off and i think we're gonna go out um so today i want to get everything done in the house that i can um i've been trying to really just like organize and declutter recently because i'm just sick of the house being a mess and just like opening a cupboard and just stuff falling out and literally we've only been in this house i'm just gonna let mercy out we've only been in this house um a couple of years so i'm like you know while we can just to try and get on top of things um and my new drawers that i got from ikea haven't filled them yet and yeah i've just got lots of cleaning tidying and all of that kind of stuff to do so if there's anything that's like aesthetically pleasing to show you um i will show you um but that's the plan for today really and probably just plan some content as well like write some blog posts edit some youtube videos so just a very kind of life admin kind of day is the plan you comfy there mm. you comfy she's so funny you watching got one paw here you giving mummy a hug? You giving cuddles? So I've just sorted out some of the cupboards and I'm now going to go in the living room with these baskets, which to be honest are a little bit grubby, but um, it shouldn't matter too much. So in the living room, we've got this TV cabinet, which this wire looks really annoying. So I'm going to have to get something to like pin it back. Um, James at the moment plays his Xbox downstairs. He eventually is going to make the spare room into like a gaming room. Um, but at the minute the Xbox is downstairs and these cupboards just get so messy with like wires and stuff. This one here, I'm pretty sure it's got like literally bits 
um, from when we made the cabinet and the TV. Macy obviously needs to come and inspect. Um, random bits of homeware, Christmas decorations. So I'm going to have a bit of a clear out and organise. And I'm going to just get the dog out of the cupboard before she eats like a screw or something. Are you so nosy? Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to put a basket, I think in each one and just try to organize things like especially this one um but that one needs a clear out as well well that's the cupboards all organized and then this one which literally has still the christmas trees at the back because there's no point obviously putting them in the loft and like tv stuff i don't know what it is about these cupboards but like macy's obsessed like if they get open she's like oh my god let me in <laughs> There's nothing edible in there. Moving on to my little shoe cabinet in the hallway. I'm really annoyed about this. <laughs> um, it's a bit of a mess. This is literally Macy's food that I've put boiling water in. And I've kept it in here because if it's on the kitchen worktop, she will just keep jumping up. Um, and I'm going to put it on her lick mat. Anyway, this drawer here, which this is Macy's bright yellow coat. Um, can't usually open it with one hand. Um, but this drawer literally was stuck shut for months, like as long as I can remember, to be honest. Um, and it is just full of random stuff. I mean, there's my necklace that I couldn't find the other day. Um, but yeah, random stuff. So I'm going to go through the drawer and have a bit of a clear out. And then I've also got some more tubs. Um, so two little blue tubs that I thought I could put in there. I've got this little um, like spinny organizer thing um which i got ages ago from tk maxx from my bedroom and um, when i lived at home and uh, it's just not a vibe like i just don't like it anymore and it ends up looking like this just very cluttered so again i'm gonna take everything out of there sort this drawer out probably put the stuff into there clean all of this hopefully find something to cover that mark um but yeah that's the next plan so this is the drawer now um all of these keys i couldn't even tell you what are for they're from like obviously when we moved in so i don't even know if they actually are for anywhere in the house that's just like become the junk drawer i've got my valentine's band and then deodorant gloves long line lead i'm going to put her harness and normal lead on top as well um because we don't currently have like a hook or any storage for her lead and um, so that's the drawer i've just put that <laughs> on top of the mark because i've got nothing to put there yet but then i've just got my little home thing um so yeah, having a little break from cleaning and I'm about to take Macy for a walk and then I think I'm going to go to Iceland with my mum. Um, I just need like a few bits, like some food to take to work Thursday, Friday. Um, I keep thinking it's Wednesday um, and I might get some more ready meals just to put in the freezer as well. So home, I'm going to sit down, make my dinner and watch Firefly Lane. Um, I've just got a few episodes left because I'm on like the last season and honestly it's so good so I'm good that it's going to end. Um, I've also seen that Queen, is it Queen Charlotte? Um, you know like the Bridgerton story, that's out so that's on my list to watch next. Um, but yeah um, and then I'll continue cleaning if I can be bothered. Are you scared of the flags? put some washing on and had a bit of an outfit change because it was actually um quite warm i took macy for a walk and i was sweating um in the jumper that i was wearing so yeah had a little outfit change ready to go to iceland we're just waiting for grandma aren't we <laughs> she loves look watching out the window are you watching I'm back from Iceland. I don't know if anyone likes watching like food shopping hauls, but whenever I watch like mainly family vloggers, I honestly love seeing what they've got. I think I'm just so nosy. So I've got some milk and Pepsi Max, which I'm gonna move over there. My grandma got me these chocolate ice creams, they're just a bit like um magnums. So I've got those. I've got some more Bliss um Biscoff flavoured whip bars. 
which are my favourite. I've got some more Slim and World salty caramel bars, some strawberries. This was like, normally I do a food shop on a Saturday, so this was just like random stuff. Um, and I literally spent all £40, so <laughs> got some crepes for James and these yogurts, which are mainly for James. I'd probably eat them too, but I've got some in the fridge already. I got James this because his, like, two of his favourite foods are lasagna and Yorkshire puddings. And I just thought this was amazing. It sounds like, it looks really nice and it sounds cool. So I'm sure he'll appreciate that. I've got myself three Slimming World meals. Um, just because I find it easy to have some of these in for when I've been at work and don't have the time to make something. So I've got a beef lasagna, paella, which doesn't have prawns in it. It's, um... Yeah, it's like sausage and things because I don't like prawns. And then I've got a chicken tikka masala. This doesn't come with rice, but I think I'm going to have it with chips. Um, and then I've got some chicken, um, like popcorn chicken for germs. Some salt and pepper chicken, also probably for germs. <laughs> and southern fried chicken, which we'll probably share if we have like wraps or something. So this is kind of just like easy, like mainly freezer food. Um... And then I've got some wholemeal pita bread instead of getting wrapped because I just fancied something a little bit different. Got some tuna for work, Thursday, Friday, just to go on some crackers. I've got James a pepperoni um, stone baked pizza, which literally goes in the microwave. And I thought that'd be quite good because he's going to be off Thursday, Friday when I'm at work. Um, and then I just got some twirls and some fiddles. So that's my little shop. doing some more washing and I've also been doing a little bit of decluttering upstairs in the bedroom I have literally been so brutal I've got a whole bin bag of stuff um for the bin and then another bin bag of stuff for charity um like I wouldn't say I'm a hoarder but I do cling on to things for a lot longer than I should um, and I do like a bit of clutter um, so I feel like the house just gets very full very easily um, and I just want everywhere to just be really nice and organised and clean and just know where everything is and just be able to keep on top of the house a lot more easily so yeah that's what I've been doing um, I'm now going to sit down and watch Firefly Lane it is literally nearly nine o'clock and I've not even had my tea yet because I had a late lunch um, so I think I'm going to just make a Slimming World ready meal and have that now uh, while watching TV um and then that's probably going to be it because james will get in about half 10 and then we'll be going to bed I don't actually feel that hungry but i just know that if i don't eat i'll be like starving through the night so i think i'm gonna have what did i get again i couldn't even remember um chicken tikka paella i think i'm gonna have this one which i already had in the fridge uh, in the freezer which is sausage i don't know how to say that but it's a smoky rice dish packed with delicious chorizo style sausages and mixed peppers so that looks good guys ignore my washing but <laughs> look how pretty the sky looks It's now Wednesday. Um, I've just spent this morning doing a bit of cleaning, a bit of planning. Um, I honestly feel so tired. Like I just don't think I slept well because it was so hot. We literally had the windows open, the fan on, and I had like a shorts and t-shirt pajama set on. Um, and I was still boiling hot, so I'm really tired today. Anyway, so I'm just going to continue doing some cleaning. Um, me and James are going to go out in a couple of hours for some lunch in town, and then. Um, after that I'm going to go and get my nails done because they are well overdue getting done um, and that's the only plans really for today the weather's quite nice again um, so 
Macy's been in the garden pretty much all morning. Um, but yeah, that's the plan for today. Um, I'm probably going to go to the gym later and then wash my hair and then I'm back at work for two days and then have the weekend off again. Cleaning the bathroom at the minute and I thought I would take all of this skincare out, clean the actual cupboard and then put stuff back in and try and do it in some kind of order because it does get a little bit messy. Um, so normally I have cleansers up here. Um, and then like toners and then like moisturizers and things so this is what it currently looks like and i'll do a little before and after so ready so this is how we're looking at the moment um these four here are for james to use he's got a cleanser a serum and um, a normal moisturizer and then a moisturizer with spf so i've kept them there um at the top i've got some of my current cleansers that i'm most using um i keep my current like serums moisturizers toners and things in the office because i normally stand um and do my skincare makeup in there but obviously i'll clean my face with the cleanser in the bathroom um, obviously that just makes sense so these bits here that i'm putting in are other skincare products that i have recently used like some of them i've been gifted some of them i got in my advent calendar but i'm going to keep these in here until i use up um like for example once i finish the serum that i'm currently using i will take one of these out when i've finished the moisturizer i'm using i'll take one of these out if that makes sense so i'm going to keep like extra stock in here because i'd normally have it in some like storage boxes in the office but they're just getting like really full and heavy um so i'm trying to like filter this to cleansers that i definitely use things that james definitely uses and then the rest are things for when i run out of what i'm currently using i can come and pick something different also trying to get rid of anything that i've had open for a while like past the date a um, bag full of stuff already um like this lemon face wash i only just used it the other day but it is obviously 12 months that you should have it open for and i've definitely had it open over 12 months now so i'm trying to get rid of things that i've actually gone out of date i'm in hand wash which i absolutely love obviously it looks a little bit grubby um but again that's 12 months and it's been open longer than that so i've moved on to this one which is the Loctane one that I was gifted um, and it smells amazing but I've not yet like properly used it so I'm going to have this in the bathroom Hi Do you want to disturb you? Hmm? So I'm just getting ready to obviously go to town and have some food. I feel like I've made so much progress with the house, but if you were to look at it, you can't really tell because obviously with me decluttering and deep cleaning, I've been like pulling everything out of cupboards and cleaning it and reorganise it and binning loads of stuff, which obviously like on the surface, you wouldn't really be able to tell. Um, but I honestly feel so much better for it. So I get much more done because obviously we're going out and then I think I'm going to go to the gym later and I need to wash my hair and things. Um, but obviously if not, I'm only at work Thursday, Friday and then I've got the weekend off again. So I'm hoping I can like somewhat finish it this week. Um, and then my focus after that will just be keeping on top of things and we've got the garage to sort out and to go to the tip and to do the garden. So yeah still lots to do Do you want to show what you're trying, James? This is like when we did that American video. Bubble tea, apple iced tea. ASMR. That's what people do, you know, like the tap on the boxes and cans and stuff. Wait, don't drink it yet. What can it, have we got a light in here? And then I've got, are you joking? Oh, there. Hello Panda, biscuits with chocolate flavour filling. They're cute. Are they worth £2.99? Probably not, but 
I'm not a sweet kind of person. Like, you know when you see, like, all the American it's sweets and stuff? It's got, like, a packet. Yeah. SMR. No, you know when you see all of them, like, American sweets and, like, stuff? And I like chocolate and biscuits. I don't... <laughs> this is not part of the video. Oh. I think we've had something like this before. Oh my nice. god, you know, I think we've got this. Can you remember <laughs> Can you remember when we were in Newcastle and we went to HMV and we were staying in a hotel and we bought candy, Winter, like American yeah. not night. No, it wasn't even American is it Japanese? I recognise it, yeah. Yeah, I think we've had these before. <laughs> so you're looking at what end though. Oh I like them though. Right, I'm gonna try mm. this. I really like the first bit, but I don't like the aftertaste. No, swap swap it up. Yeah, I don't know if we got them ones. But it's only just clicked when I literally opened them. I'll have to go back because I vlogged it, I think. Because it was mm. my birthday. Oh, and I videoed you opening that mystery box, didn't I? Mm. The one that was actually good. Mm. <laughs> Has it actually got bubble tea in? Have you got a torch on your phone? No. No, look, because it, it says we're bursting bubble. Surely it doesn't because you burst. No. Mm. I got a bubble tea in Durham on, what day was it? When we went to Durham. And I got, it was like the one that I got in London, but I preferred the one in London because the actual, are the balls called bubble tea? Is that what makes it a bubble tea? The balls? The little squidge. Anyway, I didn't like them. I like the flavour of the drink though. Can I just leave my phone there? Yeah, if you want to. Go on and get my nails done. This is the before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the I'm joking. Laugh. Luigi! <laughs> You're actually pointing it back on as well. Luigi. I nearly choked that, you know. Anyway. No, there's, there is some at the <gasps> bottom. There's bubble tea. Get I'll your torch. I'll shine try, your torch. I'll try and get out. What in your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're doing that because I, I literally cannot drink if I laugh. Like, I actually choke. It's <laughs> like you were rice. James chokes on rice for reference. Have you got it? I told you, shine your torch in it, you better see. The little balls. Well, not, yeah. Like squidgy. Can you see it? No. Can I see? Oh, no. If I can't see, you can't see. What I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. Oh, there. You don't see them? <laughs> You're going to dip it. Oh, yeah, I can. <laughs> Wait, he's, he's easily amused. Oh, my God, that is I was going to say, if it didn't, then it technically isn't a bubble tea, is it? I don't know. I'm going to have to research what bubble tea actually is. Ah, a squish one. Yeah, don't show me. <laughs> 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 You're like, uh, this is saying in my vlog, right? And if we have kids and stuff in like 50 years' time, people are going to watch this back and be like, oh, Grandad James was so weird. Good. And Grandma Chloe was so inspirational and fashionable. <sighs> Jokes, I actually noticed how fat I was when I was walking past at the shop. See how long that fork's gonna stay, then I'll go down here. At least no one can see us videoing ourselves because my bag's in the way. Until they see from behind. Yeah, it's a bit of a health and safety hazard, though, really, is, isn't it? This is gonna be the biggest test here. Whoa! Not to mention it's obscured my view. How is that? St <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm choking. 
<laughs> leave it there. But why? Why are you get back <laughs> still there? Take there. your bag off. <laughs> bag one. Well, these are my new nails. I just fancied a block colour, and I seen someone on Instagram with a similar blue to this. Um, so yeah, I'm really happy with them. So I'm now back. I've got my pajamas back on. Well, these are like my lounging around the house cleaning pajamas. <laughs> um, and yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a few hours because it's currently half four and we're going to the gym at half six. Um, so I'm just gonna relax, maybe play some games, edit some videos, and just kind of chill. I had a nice lunch, but I forgot to video it again, so I'm just gonna insert some pictures. Um, I was just too excited to eat, but yeah, I had um another tuna melt and a iced coffee. I had a walk around town and found yet another shop that sells jelly cats. I'm hoping James will get the hint because I really want one. Um, but yeah, just going to chill now. I've got the cats in here. This is my little octopus thing that you turn inside out. Ruby's on the cat chair and Molly's on the windowsill. Um, and now I'm going to go downstairs. And yeah, just really obsessed with this nail colour. So I've just been in the shower after the gym, excuse the mascara under my eyes. Um, I am just about to make tea. I think we're just gonna have wraps um, and watch a bit of TV. Um, so I'm gonna end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. If you have, especially if you've got this car far, um, you'll have to let me know in the comments. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog next weekend because um, obviously I've just had five days off and then last week I had five days off and I've done a lot of vlogs and a lot of content. And I think I need a bit of a break. <laughs> I'm a bit tired. Um, so we'll see. But yeah, thank you for watching. Like I said, I do have some PR um, beauty hauls coming up. I've done, obviously, the little vlog um, from when we went to Windermere. Um, what else have I done? I've done a day in the life as a body shop consultant video. So that will be on my channel, if not already soon um but yeah i will see you in my next video and i will leave all my links below because i obviously still post quite a lot on like instagram and things so yeah